He's been a, a remarkable businessman and, and leader here in, uh, in, in the United States. He's helped build the economic alliance between the United States and Japan for decades. He's had an incredible career at one of the most important companies here in Tennessee, a company that has built its presence here and employed thousands of Tennesseans. And Greg was looking forward to his retirement from that storied career, and unfortunately his retirement was cut short. Uh, a very regrettable situation that occurred. It took over three years to get him home, but today I'm delighted to be here to welcome Greg back. So welcome again, Greg. Thank you. The cell was probably about as big as this table in area. You had to sit a certain way all day. There was no heat. Lights were on 24 hours a day. Um, and you don't get much human co uh, contact in, unless you're being interrogated by the prosecutors. My legal team, uh, Jamie Wareham is one of the key lawyers on this legal team, is, is going to appeal the case and try to attain a full acquittal because I got a mostly acquittal in a 99.4% jurisdiction. The three attorneys I had were formidable. They were outstanding. But the system is designed to convict. It's a prosecution system. It is not a criminal justice system. Some of the most fascinating things that we all take for granted in this country, the protections we have as citizens, if we get caught in this situation, you just don't have in Japan. In Tennessee, I have some very good friends, many of whom are here. I need to drink a little wine and beer with them and catch up. I haven't seen them for three years. 